I've been using Samsung Galaxy Watch 5 Pro in the last two months and I gotta say, I love this watch. This is one of the best smartwatches ever made. Let's review. Samsung introduced its new flagship wearable device four months ago. Since then, Pixel Watch by Google and Apple Watch Ultra introduced. Both of them are great smartwatches, but this one was the one which won my heart. Let's start with body design and chassis. It's well made. It's made out of titanium and I love the build quality here. I accidentally hit it to the wall, to the glass, to the wood and everything it hits, it doesn't shatter. I love the bezel here, it's protective for its screen and it's protected its screen a lot of time for me. I managed to hit my watch all the time in the wall and wood, I said, as I said. And I think it's one of the best looking smartwatches out there, especially with this Google Pixel Watch watch face I have here. I managed to install a Pixel Watch watch face on this watch with its APK via developer mode and Wi-Fi routing. Uh, it was amazing and it was easy to do. I will talk about it later on the video when I want to talk about wearables. As I said, the display was amazing and it has almost 1000 nits of brightness. If you want to see how much this display is durable, you can check out Jerry Everything video. I will link it below this video. Uh, he said it was sapphire. And I can prove it because this is uh, one of the most durable watches ever. This watch has two buttons over there and one of them called action button with red ring around it. And I love this design, especially in the black edition. Uh, it's so cool. I love matte black and this is matte black. I love it. I don't like the olive, uh, olive-ish color. I don't prefer that color. I prefer this one, uh, which is black. And I can say that I don't like the look on this watch. But as much as I love this watch, I have one major problem with this device. Uh, this device is 45 millimeter device and it's huge for a smartwatch and I like uh, huge smartwatches, don't get me wrong. Uh, I love Apple Watch Ultra because it's huge. But the problem here is Samsung made, made its watch with 20 millimeter strap and 20 millimeter straps are usually too small for this size. And I have problem with that and my strap that I bought myself uh, was too small for this watch and I should gift it to my sister who has Galaxy Watch 4 from Samsung. And it was good on her watch, but on my watch it was too small. Samsung has managed to add a lot of sensors on this watch, like ECG, heart rate, blood pressure, and so many others that you will see on other watches and other smart bands. Uh, the problem here is if you want to use your ECG or your blood pressure sensor on this watch, you need Samsung phone. You need Samsung phones to use Samsung Health Monitor app, which is only available on Samsung Galaxy App Store. And this is ridiculous. Why Samsung? I know you want to sell your phones, but I love your watch, but not your, not your phones. I like to have OnePlus or Pixel phones, but I love to have your watch. And I think this is the wrong thing to do. Please add support for other Android phones, please. The most lovely thing about this watch is Wear OS 3.5. Samsung switched from Tizen to Wear OS last year with Galaxy Watch 4, and this year there is Galaxy Watch 5 and 5 Pro with Wear OS 3.5. I love this OS. Uh, you have lots of freedom to do with your watch, like uh, installing APKs, adding watch faces, and everything is fine and lovely here. I like Samsung design here, but I like Google design more. Because of that, I installed Google watch faces here, as I said before, and this is good. This is good looking watch. I love this thing and 
I can easily change and manage them in Samsung wearable app, which is nice. I thought I can't manage them on Samsung app, but I can manage them. And the weird thing is this watch isn't compatible with Google Wear OS app. It only works with Samsung wearable app, which is weird, but it's okay. And my problem with software in this watch, you can't uninstall Samsung apps. You can't uninstall s -Hubs. You can't uninstall Samsung messaging. You can't uninstall Samsung contacts and lots of other things that I don't like. I prefer Google apps more from Samsung apps and you can't uninstall them. Uh, both in this watch and Samsung phones, which is sucks. I hate this thing. Give me more freedom. I choose Android for freedom, not for isolating me with some apps that I don't like. Battery life is good here. I think it's one of the best battery lives on Wear OS smartwatches. Uh, I managed to have uh, almost a week with this watch and one charging in between. I, I had a trip and in that trip, I only needed to charge this watch only once and it was great. I loved this thing and I loved battery life here. Uh, you can have three days of battery life, but you should uh, be a little easy on the watch to see three days of battery life, but you can manage to have it or you can manage to have more with uh, turning off always on display or some other thing, and like uh, using your heart rate sensor a little less. Uh, but I think it's acceptable by it's having Wear OS, which is a little heavy. I had a Strava and Google Fit app on this watch and when I had this, my watch barely works for a day or a day and a half and they juiced up my battery a lot. I don't know why. But when I installed them, they worked fine. I don't know why. Maybe it's a software issue, maybe they're uh, using too much battery but here's the thing you can't install uh, three or four health apps at the same time because it juice up your battery about sensors and other things uh, such as workout there are uh, maybe better reviews on the YouTube like uh, Mike O'Brien review of this watch because I don't work out much it's obvious why and if you want to see how it can perform when you are work uh, you are doing workout or some other things i link a video from mike o'brien under this video you can check it out thanks for watching if you like this video please subscribe to our channel and like this video give me your opinion in the comments thanks